All right, so I wanted to kind of give an overview of my whole setup for today's ride. As you can see, I got a Physique Argon 3D saddle. I wanted to talk about real quick and uh, I guess another chance at this Control Tech um, bag. I didn't put anything in here, but I just kind of used it for the, the drinking thing. So you can see my average speed with the way it was. Average speed 21. I try to maintain 20, so I reached my goal. It was pretty windy today. I couldn't really hang because of the wind and also the climbs. But it's my normal loop. So looking at the saddle. Okay. I got I fell into the hype because my butt kind of changed basically. So a lot of friends got the S Works Power. 3d print saddle um i got this one for sale on bike closet it's not really it was like for like what almost 100 bucks off um it's a little more narrow it's 140 the other one is for uh, i think the power is 143 i don't think that matters but i guess it might matter to me because i normally like narrow wear saddles uh, position if only i moved the position i think all the way forward i think i would have enjoyed it more being that <coughs> Sorry. Being that I was like mostly in the TT position, the arrow position. Uh so the first 20 miles it was okay. Afterwards it started getting like uh kind of uncomfortable around here or right here, I guess. This netting right here. As you can see, the saddle is very it's very flexible, soft up here. So it goes hard, softish, soft, and I guess the soft is like this whole corner tip right here of the nose um this part's really flexible the saddle is also flexible you see, as you can see my hand i can like literally just like fold it by using just my normal strength uh i'm not sure if that's good or bad as i don't know about road buzz or anything you didn't really notice anything because it's so bouncy probably absorb all the shock other than that um a short 20 something miles so it was the main highlight of the bike. I wanted to kind of see if I can find a saddle that could work with my endurance uh, rides that I plan on doing in the future. For now, I just put on this bike. So maybe it's not the right saddle for this bike. I don't know. But I kind of wanted like one saddle do all. In the past, I used, uh, what's it called? Pro Stealth Saddles. Uh, they were good at first, but then afterwards, they were just like super hard and hurt me a lot and damaged me and, uh, soft skin damage tissue damage um yeah so kind of ran a rant uh everything was good bike did good fitness is lacking wind was horrible but i made it happen so i'm gonna show the end result 20 mile average and that's it